Now, as to future returns, you've probably read what I've had to say about this. We're looking for, we'll go through this quickly, Mike, 6%, uh, 4% for stocks, and you can see 6% fundamental return minus 2% speculative return, lower valuations. And uh, for bonds, way below the, since 1974, 8% versus 3.5%. So I, I think combination returns of bonds and stocks could be, and we'll, we'll, we will use this chart, could be more like 4% compared to 12%. These are equities only. 12% uh, over Vanguard's history. 12%. I mean, you guys that have been investors that time, most of it uh, last, um, well, I've got, I've got 60 years here. Nobody's been that. But uh, 60 years, it's kind of an investor's lifetime today. And look what happens when you compound at 12% versus 4. And the math is easy. You divide the number into 72 and see how often it will double. So at 12%, you double every 6 years. And at 4%, you double it every 18 years. So at 4% after 60 years, your original dollar goes to $11. And at 12%, your original dollar goes to $898. So those small differences in return, or even the big differences in return, the differences of return, more or less than I expect, suggest that we are basically uh, our reasonable expectations uh, are better save more money, we'll better save more money, get, better get more costs out of the equation. And uh, so, so when I get to, I'm going to go over to 72 now, I guess I'm not alone. Um, my number for future equity returns of around 4% is shared by just about everybody. It's amazing. Uh, AQR, which is Cliff Asnes, 4.2%. Keith Ambach here, Canadian, who writes a really refined, thoughtful newsletter, 4.5%. BlackRock, 4 Vanguard, 3 to 5 GMO, that's Jeremy Grantham, minus 4.7. That's the only outlier. State Street, 4.1%. So do I take cover in this being, you know, the same as everybody else? No, because I was brought up with the idea that the crowd is always wrong. <laughs> so who knows what to expect? You don't need, need to take that as gospel. Uh, and in, in the wrapping up, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to skip the wrapping up page and go to 